We're no longer the good roads state. We're the ailing roads state. Highway advocates say if you look at this research as a school report card, North Carolina is failing. Mostly we have to be sort of ashamed at our grades. The report issued today with the support of state transportation officials and private groups shows bad road conditions are costing both the state and its drivers. In fact, the report shows problems like congestion, car accidents, and bad road conditions are costing every driver in the Raleigh-Durham area an extra $1,350 a year. State officials say there are many projects to do and fixes to make, like widening parts of I-40, but there's just no money. Bottom line is our needs are growing in North Carolina. Our revenue stream is not. So if we do need $65 billion over the next 20 years, then the question is, who's going to pay for it? We need to continue to work hard to do more with less, but I don't think at the end of the day that's going to get the job done. DOT Secretary Gene Conti says the state's looking at options that count on drivers to pay up. A breakdown shows options include increasing the gas tax, more toll roads, a user tax making you pay based on how many miles you drive, and counties raising their sales taxes to fund transportation. So it's really uh, you know, making the user pay for the value that they receive by being able to go where they want to go when they want to go. Plus, they say federal aid is crucial to help steer the state's transportation system in the right direction. Justin Moss, NBC 17 News.